guys, how you doing? It's Beth. I'm so excited. Um, we're what, like five days into January and already I'm backed up. Um, I still have <laughs> my bag full of my prizes that I still have to get out. Um, Misha's Authentique. I got I got Maria's stuff, I got Mary Beth's, I, you name it, it's in there. Um, the thing is, is that my daughter moved to a new apartment this weekend, you know, this last week, the first. And um, so we ended up needing all the money to help with that. It's very expensive, let me tell you what, to move into an apartment, because you need all new stuff, you know? So anyway, I'm gonna get all that out. Um, the um, ATC cards that I have from Audrey, um, who is Windy Days Designs from um, October's, October's Challenge. Yeah, I haven't gotten out yet. So she is, you know, had sent for the November, December Challenge. I'm not gonna pull the winners for that one yet, um, only because I can't send them out yet. So I'll wait on that one. But. Um, I will do the other names, but we got a whole crap a load, a whole crap of stuff, a whole load of stuff, whatever it is, you know what I mean. So, um, first, um, I wanted to thank Judy, who is JW Scraps. She'd actually sent me, it was a whole long thing, I ate everything. I think some of it was cardboard, don't know for sure, but there was definitely chocolate and stuff inside. Isn't that so nice? And she had sent um, this gift. Um, happy holidays, Beth. Thanks for the laughs, the hauls, and the love and caring for all of the wonderful causes you support. Isn't she so nice? Holy crap. Um, you video, your videos are priceless and loved by all. <sighs> Whatever. But thank you, Judy. So this, how cute is this? Like, even alone, this would have been fine. But, you know, the rest of it was really good, too. I didn't even show my kids because I knew that they would steal. And I don't, you know, I don't share. When it comes to food, you know, they're on their own as far as I'm concerned. Once they learned how to crawl, I figured they can pick stuff up off the floor themselves. They don't need me. So that's all there is. So thank you, Judy. Um, Nancy, who is always adorned, sent three huge boxes. And I'm going to open those. So there is no rhyme or reason to what I'm doing. I just have to get this all done um, so that I can get the stuff out and we can move on to January's challenge, which it's now January 5th. January, just like last month, last January, is for um, St. Jude's Hospital. Um, it does not have to be a card. It can be anything that's Valentine's Day themed. So it could be a coloring book or stickers um, if you don't make cards. Or it can be a card and it can be a blank card that um, either the families can use um, or the patients, you know, the kids can use to give to each other or to their families or to the nurses and doctors, whatever, that's fine. Um, last year I know people sent things with candy and candy um, cannot be given to the kids but I sent a huge box to the nursing department. There was a whole nother department that I sent all that stuff to and they very much appreciated that. So whatever floats you boat, people. Um, and um, as you know, um, Alice, uh, Alice in Wonder One, who's Katie, um, who graciously um, donated this 12 by 12, um, the Magic of Oz paper pad which of course made me have to go out and get an eight by eight. I couldn't afford a 12 by 12, the eight by eight paper pad, which was something like $80. So this is quite a gift. And it's funny because Erin, who is Queen E, who does my list for me, thank you so much, by the way. Um, and she wrote, it's so funny what she wrote on this. Um, let me see if I can find it really fast. Um, October, hold on one second, because she's so funny. I mean, something about like having her head checked or something, you know? I don't know, whatever it was. Crap, I can't find it. Oh, okay, here. Katie, Alice in Wonder One. Might need a brain scan for sending. 
Graphic 45 Wizard of Oz 12 by 12 paper pad for January prizes. Isn't that so funny? She's so funny. And by the way, Erin, um, Erin got a big kick for um, Herbert for Christmas. So she's getting, because she makes cards. So I'm sending this to you and um, the embossing folders as well as a thank you. So I don't know what I would do without her, honest to God. I'm looking at this list. It's five pages long of just everything. I mean, you name it, everything. In fact, here it says, um, one of them, um, Charlotte Miller for Audrey, send Hello Kitty car activity board. Did I do that? I don't know. See, I don't know. And for Love My Two Pugs One, dog can cozy. I know I didn't do that because I found it when I was cleaning. See, I need this. So Erin, thank you so much. That's Queenie E if you want to check out her channel. Um, and I don't know what I would do without you. So thank you. This is going out in the mail to you. Let me put that in my big bag here because that's all stuff to go out. Okay. The other thing I wanted to mention for January, not for, for November, December, which I'll talk to you about in just a second. For January also, um, Natasha, who is Minashka, Minashka, I think it is, on YouTube. She also has a store, which I absolutely love, and I got um, I got my package from it, and I will show it to you. Anyway, um, let me see, there must be a card in here. You know what, now that I'm thinking about it, instead of looking. She has generously um, donated uh, money, toward, like gift cards, towards her store. Amazing. Okay, so it's, um, it's Natasha Scrapbook corner and I will put underneath um, the name so that you know um, but what she is going to do um, she's such a sweetheart so what she's going to do is she's going to do a ten dollar let me look it up again and make sure I got this right I should have been prepared for this but you know me I'm not prepared for anything um, and the way it'll work is there's a code so wh whoever the winner is I will give you the code for the ten dollar, um, the fifteen, and the twenty or twenty-five. Let me just see if I can find it here. I'm telling you, I have not even like looked at these things. Oiga vault. Okay, so ten dollars, fifteen dollars, and twenty dollars. Okay, so the number is a fixed discount for ten dollars. Um, 15 or 20 with minimum purchase of 10. Okay, so you have to spend $10. It's not like you can buy something for a dollar and then get $9 back. It doesn't work that way. Um, and that's without shipping. So it's $10. Any, and believe me, her prices are crazy, like crazy cheap. You will be able to get quite a bit for $10. Um, but then you will have to pay for the shipping, obviously. But the $10... Um, then one for $15 and one for $20. And again, um, it is for um, that. You have to spend that amount. You can't, you know, she's not going to just give you cash or whatever. You do need to spend it um, and pay for the shipping. And that's it um, in the United States. If it's outside of the United States, I will cover the shipping um, beyond whatever it would be in the United States. So, Because I, I really, the way I feel, and I know a lot of people have, do it differently and and that's fine I totally understand that to me it's worth it to have everyone participate um, I don't care where you come from where you live if you participate if you send me something for a challenge for these kids or whatever you deserve to be involved in the in the um, you know the chance of, of winning so um, I'll deal with that with with uh, Natasha but anyway so isn't that so nice of her um, and I had ordered from her um, I had ordered from her and I'll show you quick 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 is a bunny <laughs> do you see how calm I am tonight isn't it so nice it's like it was so crazy last week because I don't know what happened we ended up having New Year's at our house I did not want to do that but it ended up like, and then I was like, okay, fine. You know what? We're going to have people over, but I'm not putting a darn thing up. But of course, you know, I had to do that. And then I was like, I'm not getting anything for the kids to play with. Too bad. Let them just sit on their hands. But of course, then I have to buy them stuff. What can I tell you? I can't help it. 
Um, so I got trim, lots of trim. She's got such beautiful stuff. So I got the um, some black, the sequin trim, and the silver. You can see it very well. This is gorgeous. This one right here, I love this. I'm gonna have to get some more of this because this is just now that I'm seeing it like in person. The pictures, like in her on her sh on her store, just do not do her justice. I I'm gonna put the information down along the bottom, just so she knows. Um, but um, yeah, and then oh yeah, these are the bottles, um, the fairy bottles. Because like I said, I'm gonna be doing fairy bottles for um, for the um, crafts fairs I'm gonna be doing next year. Because I really missed it. I really did. Okay, anyway, sorry. Oops. And then this one here, which is um, the oval-shaped trim. I don't know if you can see. Like a whole crap load of it. And then this one here, which is the, like the twisty, twirly kind. Because I was thinking around the frames, you know, for my 3D pictures that I'm making. That would be nice. And, oh, I needed green leaves because the, um, I had gotten that dye. I don't know if you would remember it. Um, it was like a doily, but it's a double thing so I could like attach at the bottom and then put stuff inside it. Um, I ended up having to get... Um, I didn't realize this when I got the dye, but you need the actual, like the embossing thing to go with it. So I got that on Amazon. So that's what it looks like there, see? And then you're supposed to put flower, I mean, um, leaves and then flowers, like over where the, you can't see a thing, can you? I know, take my word for it. Um, so I got these little, um, oops, little plastic leaves. There's Anyway, so I got a bag of those, and then I got red sequin bling, and then I got these because um, these ones have uh, the Eiffel Tower on them, um, because I had done, um, when I had done the um, craft spheres before, I had done kits, little scrapbook kits that the kids could buy. Those were really big sellers, like the parents bought them for their kids. Um, I'm going to do, instead of just all Christmas, I'm going to do different themes because um, that way, you know, they have, they can use it like for birthday presents and things like that. Um, but anyway, so I wanted to get some little plastic things to put like the embellishments that I would put in the bag. So I, I got those as well because she sells those. And then um, this is especially for you. Now, I don't know, did I buy this? I don't remember. But it's more of the, I think I bought these because it's, I got like all of the trim that she had because it's just so gorgeous and so perfect. So perfect for what I want. And this mesh. And this is a gift for me. Oh, thank you. These are fun. These are little flowers. I won't take it out of the thing, but you can see it. Look how pretty. I love it. I just bought a crap load of Valentine's Day stuff. Um, as you know, for the prizes for um, the November, December um, challenge, it's whatever you want. So if you choose to have like um, a particular paper pad, that's fine if you would like um, a, a, a kit like a, um, I sent Paige I sent paper pads she wanted the six by six um, Tara I sent the Christmas um, kit she wanted that and as it turns out um, thank God for Aaron again um, Shirley Shirley Revels and Sharon Sharon DeBracco both of you um, are winners from the November because I said whoever sent in November, because there was like nobody who sent in November, except for you four. Um, and so you guys choose what you want. So Tara and um, 
page already got their prizes. So if you just um, email me, and again, I'll put that information at the bottom of this video and tell me what you want. It can be anything you want. It could be a kit, it could be a paper pad. I got paper pads up the wazoo, you know that. Um, if you want stuff to alter, whatever it is. You know, you have somebody's birthday coming and you want, you know, to do something that's like girly or boy themed or whatever, just let me know. So, um, yeah. So anyway, that is, um, so that is, yeah, so this is the card. Um, but again, I will put it down at the bottom. Her, her store is on Zibit and it's called Natasha's Scrapbook Corner. And book with the K is also the K used in the word corner. It's very confusing. I'm sorry. You'll find her. I'll, I'll help you. <laughs> um, okay, so then, let me move this stuff out of the way. Okay, and I showed you that. Okay. I've been playing with this because you know what? I got in from Joanne's the paper. Um, this is the the paper that I had ordered. Isn't that cute? And then the other side looks like this. So I'm just, I started playing with the boxes. The box, because I got the, um, Uyghur Vault. It's sitting on top of something. Okay. So I got the box, um, punch and just was playing with it. I haven't done a very good job with it, but I just want to do quick, quick, quick. The paper bag one, all right, that's not so easy. I thought I could just do a quick as you, you know, quick as a bunny kind of a thing, um, but no. This is going to take a little, a little thought, and that one I'm going to have to work on. But it'll be good. Again, I'm thinking craft fairs and things like that and prizes for people. Um, and then I got this, which I think is just so great for um, the cards that I never remember to put in your packages. Um, I know I already have that blessings one, but I love this one too. It says, be the change you want to see in the world. Don't you love that? I love that. Anyway, so I got that. Um, and then I had gotten... Um, this is from Oriental Trading, again, for my kits, because last time when I made the scrapbook kits, I included um, crayons and um, glue stick, um, as well as the scrapbook and the embellishments and stuff. So I got on clearance, because Oriental Trading still has their clearance stuff going on. So if you go to, um, to their website, and now they have something like... It's like $5 off of $49 plus free shipping um, on anything. So, I mean, if you're getting Valentine's Day stuff or if you're getting, um, if you have a birthday coming up, whatever. Um, and then I got just a crap load of um, the holiday pencils to go with something. I don't know what. I don't know. I don't know. And then I wanted to do something like what um, Susan Bibber did. I wanted to scrap lift her idea of doing the reindeer noses, you know, where you use the malt balls and then one like red gumball in a bag with, you know, and then the paper goes over it. I think I showed it to you. Um, and then you put a picture of a reindeer on the front. I couldn't find reindeer, but um, I found this, which is like pieces of it. So you have to like put it together. It's foam, so it's heavy duty. I mean, we're not fooling around here. This is serious stuff. I'm not even joking. See, how cute is that? And then you can like decorate it with all this stuff. So I got that. And then, because I do my, um, also my recipe books with, um, inside I include the sugar cookie recipe and the gingerbread cookie recipe. And also a spatula, a cookie cutter, um, cookie mix, okay, what else I put in there? Recipe cards, and it's in like one of my, you know, like a mini album kind of a thing. Um, so this is 500 pieces. And these are also foam, but they're really cute. They're like, there's gingerbread, there's a gingerbread house, there's like cat, there's all just kinds of fun stuff. 
So, and again, keep in mind, people, I'm showing all this to you because, you know, if you're a winner and you see something and you're like, hey, I'd like a handful of that crap, you know, uh, not crap, but really, really great stuff, um, just let me know. See, there you go. Okay, so I think that's everything I, oh, you know what else I got? Um, this I 